atmosphere. Very, very good atmosphere. So now that we busted the specters from New Folsom, let's see what the upgrades actually cost. I do believe they are quite pricey. The specters, of course. Now in our inventory, a side effect of the specter training regiment is a marked increase in eccentricity. Many specters carry totems or other trinkets to enhance their abilities. There is a speculation that the Dominion still uses specters in a number of operations, despite the ostensible shutdown of the program. Specters, tell me, you ever seen a specter? See? No? Because they don't exist. Gabriel Tosh, rumored to be the first specter, speaking to Sip Rocher of the Emoji News Service. Miss Rocher disappeared a week later and has not been seen since. Yeah, evening, Sarfanger. We are playing some StarCraft. One of the best and most fun RTSs I think I've ever played. Definitely worth a replay. Ah, that's the psionic lash. Now the lash does a tremendous amount of damage to a single target. 200, which is pretty good. It's not going to kill an Ultralisk or a Thor in one go, but it will kill most of anything else. Now, this in combination with the stun that the Spectres have make them extremely powerful. That enhanced with this one, the cloak no longer requires energy. Absolute monster units. You can actually do missions with these guys alone. The beginning. Paul Kovnik, you you really don't like the, the look of all these uh, of all these characters, do you? Now we are gonna have to start with the cloak, because we are going to use the Spectres, again. We are not going to power game this entire campaign. I'm going to have some fun with this. It's been a while since i played this. And I want to use the Spectres. Any... No, let's leave that. Swan, that what do you got? That character gave me the data for building more Spectre gear. You sure we can trust that guy? I heard he was into brainwashing or something. Tosh can only recruit volunteers to become Spectres. That's the deal. He works them hard so they won't go off the rails when they get their full specter powers. No brainwashing involved. Good to know. Wouldn't want any of those freaks running loose causing trouble. Aside from Tosh, that is. Yeah, be careful. Don't let that guy hear you. He seems to be quite everywhere. Such as right now, there. I took a big chance with you and your specters, Tosh. I hope Nova wasn't right about you. <laughs> don't go believing that little girl's lies. This Spectre procedure affects everyone differently, but we're all still human. It's our choice whether to become Spectres, not hers, not yours. Next. No, Pukovnik. This be the only true freedom anyone gets. But can I trust him? Can I trust you? Don't you worry, man. We'll fight for you right to the end. All my brothers and sisters. We owe you everything. Are the sisters as jacked as the brothers? <laughs> Sorry. Bokovnik, maybe in your version of the StarCraft lore, all these guys, when they left Earth, they were actually gorilla human hybrids. Maybe that's why they all look so jacked. Let's see what Tigers has to say about any of this. Thought you'd want to hear. Tosh is officially thrown in with our little revolution. He's going to lend us his specters to help out. You sure got us. Looks like a dwarf from Warcraft. Jimmy. You gotta go easy on these characters, man. Old Megs got him locked up for a reason. Megs locked them up because they were just weapons to him. They deserve a shot at living their lives outside a cage. Mm. Just like anyone else. I could else. use a bit of a drink right now. I actually still have some. I mean, I played World of Warcraft. And I just can't see anything other than WoW characters. But that's, that's what Blizzard does. They make the same sort of art style everywhere. It's the same cartoony... Like, everyone is fucking jacked. All the... You know, let's not even go there. Breaking news. Reports coming in today suggest... The dicks are massive. The tits are massive. Kate, the muscles are massive. Everything's massive. The swords. The armor. New Folsom prison. Dominion security forces are on high alert as some of the prisoners were former members of Project Shadowblade, which we've discovered to be a subversive offshoot of the Dominion's ghost program. A number of political dissidents were also freed during the attack. Do we know who did this, Kate? 
Was it Rainer's Raiders? The evidence we have suggests it was, Donnie. There you have it. To immediately cut off. I like it. A little more dangerous tonight. From the UNN studios on Core Hall, I'm Donnie Vermillion. Donnie damn Vermillion. For the real bad guys, Donnie. You should be worried. Alabama. Where the sky is always blue. Somehow, you know, like looking at this whole thing with all this like so ragtag band and this sweet home Alabama playing in the background, this is some sort of style. It has something that I can't find in any other game. James, I thought you might want this to remember how we broke New Falls in prison. MX Dominion, I'm with you all the way, brother. Gabriel Tosh. Do not pick up hitchhikers. No! Don't worry, they won't be picking up hitchhikers because as soon as someone breaks out, there'll be a neatly lined Hellion, Siege Tank, Diamondback, and who knows what else. Right next to them. Laboratory. Warcraft 3 art style is the best. I do like it. Blizzard art style ages quite well because it doesn't have too much details. I completely agree. Which is also why I think that this game holds up beautifully even today. Dr. Hansen. Jim, I've been investigating the claims that Nova made about the Spectres turning into psychotic killers. Give us a good news. Honestly, there's no evidence that Spectres are any more prone to aberrant behavior than ordinary people. Oh, what do you know? Increase in she ability was lying. could induce a psychotic break, but Spectres aren't the monsters we were led to believe. Nova lied to us. Well, I mean, call her me shocked, eh? I'm gonna grab myself a glass and a drink, ladies and gentlemen. I will be back in Two minutes. Count them. 120 seconds really do. Count them. Family's blasting music downstairs. I'm surprised you can't hear it here. As soon as I opened the door, I was like, yep. They're doing their thing. I really gotta get that standing mic set up. Not only is that microphone quality better, but it also prevents the issue of me breathing into the mic, which honestly annoys me to no end. Probably as much as it annoys you. Oh, that is not as much as I had hoped for, but you know. Let's put that down there. For all the people on YouTube, it has been eight and a half hours since I started streaming, so I am due a drink. Most days, I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. Just chasing my. Well, maybe if you eased off on the alcohol, man, you'd get a purpose in life. It's your sense of justice that's kept us on this road. Matt, my interest in justice burned out a long time ago. I've spent my whole life fighting. I've killed. I've ordered good men to their deaths. And for what? Yo, we saw that. Maybe that's why I drink so much. Have left. It's guys like you that'll build something better after all the smoke clears. That's because you gave us something to believe in, sir. I'll never give up the fight. And that's a promise. I feel like Jimmy needs a little bit of perspective. But who am I to tell someone else what My to do with their lives? A new colony on Haven. It was going well, but now the colony's gone dark. All right, we already listened to that Mr. one. Ah, yes, Tors. Queen of Blades figured out who's been paying us to snatch up all the. Was about to say Tarsonus, like what? No, attacking his main research campus on Tirador. Mm. He can't evacuate his people until all their artifact research is safe. Alright, how about we do this? 
We do one last mission, that being Haven, and then we switch over to Darkest Dungeon. Send some more people to the demise. Because, I mean, if you followed yesterday, you know exactly how that's gonna go. That was fun, though. Haven, but I wanna play some more of that. Sir, there's a Protoss fleet holding in orbit. They're disrupting all communications to the surface. And it looks like they're powering up their main weapons. That's a problem. Jim, you have to stop this. Matt, open a channel to the Protoss. Let's see how diplomatic they're feeling. Intaro Tassadar, James Raynor. I am Executor Selendis. Your bravery and service to Ayer are known to us. Intaro Tassadar, Selendis. Listen, with all due respect, your fleet needs to pull back. No, I think I'd recognize that as for his act of risk. I'll listen for it, though. They must be purified. If you wish to undertake this mission in our stand, we will permit it. Jim, some of my people No, are not the same voice actors. But you can't let the Protoss just destroy them all. If you keep the Protoss at This is a deeper voice. I know I can find Unless they ran it through a synthesizer, but I doubt the that. The only cure for Zerg infestation is purification by fire. You know this to be true, James Raynor. I can cure them, Jim. Believe me. If you choose to resist us, we will meet in glorious combat. The choice is yours, James Raynor. We await your answer. Yeah, it does somewhat sound familiar to Liar from Mass Effect, but it's not the same voice actress. I'm 97% sure. Do we protect the colony, or do we purify the colony? Now, both of these missions are pretty good, but which one do we pick, ladies and gentlemen? I don't mind. You get the same units, you get different research, but I really don't mind. Do we have a preference over in chat? <laughs> Everyone's like, are you a traitor? Protect them. Yeah. Personally, I find finding the Protoss to be easier. Perch the Xenos come. Alright. Let's do it. Let's protect the colony. I ain't gonna stand by while you wipe out a whole colony, Salendus. Not while there's still a chance we can save them. Then it shall be an honor to meet you on the field of battle. Your reputation as a commander is most impressive. I trust you will live up to it. Thank you, Jim. Thank you so much. This very much seems like suicide. My people don't deserve to be wiped out. We'll make this right. I'll find a cure. Jim, the Protoss are already closing in on the colony. My people don't stand a chance. We're gonna have to stop that purifier of theirs before it can wipe the whole place out. Get everyone evacuated to the main base, Ariel. If the purifier gets that far, we're done. Or at least we can count on them being methodical. They'll stop to burn every settlement along the way. You sure know how to pick a fight, cowboy. I got something that'll help you. I called in some favorites and got us Viking schematics. Remember, they can change from a jet into a combat walker and back again. Pretty nifty stuff. Jim, the purifier's drawing power from several don't, don't do, exits. Don't do that, you stupid fucks. What are you doing? How can you stop something like that? Well, not like that. Easy. We knock out those Nexi first, then we take down the purifier. Don't worry, Ariel. We'll stop them. Just tosses in five marines and three goliaths. It's like, yeah, that'll help. Mothership units can even fly or fire while on the move. It literally didn't even slow them down. All right, let's do this. What's going? Ah. Transformation system. I've located the Protoss Nexuses that are channeling power to the purifier. Nexi, not Nexus. We'll have to destroy them before we can stop the purifier. No armory? All right. Automated refinery. 
Yes. Now we can just make these and then put them right back to work. We should be ready no reason to not to make them at the start. Attack. Oh, don't worry, I'll assist them. Let's see, is there anything to gain over here before the protos burn into death? Alright, look. I mean, we do know that real men drill deep. Not enough of course, not enough minerals. How's the supply? Okay, supply is good. Um, anything else? We oh, I mean, I mean, I'd love to do this with specters, but this is a time mission. Sadly, we will not have the chance. Though, I mean, we do have like three gas, right? So, might as well. How much the shadow ops? Not as much as I expected. Roger, sir. Purifier has arrived and is on the move. Made for Not enough minerals. Go on. on. Get me my Not minerals. minerals. SCV ready. Yeah, one of these days I will order a uh, stand-up mic from uh, Amazon. So you guys won't have to listen to me. Uh, breathe in the mic. It will also increase the quality of the voice, by the way. Or the sound. That's not a purifier. I know, it does say purifier. The purifier's coming into range of a colony base. Invulnerability shield. If only we could get that in multiplayer, these ships might actually be useful. Right. Armory. Whoa, 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 whoa. Stop that. Well, that sucked. Uh, okay, we need a science vest. Actually, we don't have... We don't have the bloody... Does this thing detect? It probably does. Yes, it does. And there's cannons everywhere in this, in this mission, so... Uh, Spectre, sadly, not an option. We'll just have to do this the uh, old-fashioned way, I'm afraid. Very well. Uh, which means we also need another one to actually build the science vessels. Where's my armory? Sir, detecting a massive energy spike. The purifier is about to fire. Don't worry, Matt. <laughs> we'll be fine. I can see the flare from here. And supply. Uh -huh. What's going on? Not enough minerals. Not enough minerals. Not enough minerals. Now, put these guys in the bunker. I mean, we could still use them by putting them in the bunker, but that's obviously not what they're for. Commander, a Protoss squadron is going after the colony ships. All right. Those people don't stand a chance unless we stop. Oh, don't worry. Man. We got Vikings. Anti-capital ship units. And we got attack upgrades for them right on the way. We'll be fine. They do more damage versus armored anyway. Focus fire. I don't actually think you get this armory. Even if you do win, which is unfortunate. Let's, uh, let's get that. The colonists have evacuated the first settlement in the purifier's path. They really don't get this. I mean, it would be the really, really useful. Even if it's just for evacuated. one upgrade. We should pick them up. No? Okay. Hot. Modest civilian residence. Standard biodome. Used for minor terraforming and advanced hydroponics operations. Is under attack. No. Oh, that's a... That is a... That's a big boy. Uh, right, Hercules. Requires fusion core, I don't have that. Uh, P for plating. In the rear with Build another one. Transformation systems prime. Okay, well. Let's get into the fight. Why did I decide to build the stuff there? That was foolish. Alright, kill that, please. Oh, that's a charged up void ray. We can kite it. That was costly. All right, we need that uh, science vessel pretty badly. 
First, we gotta spend a little bit of time building up. I don't actually think more SCPs helps here. We're already saturated. One, two, three, four, seven. Okay, so we only needed 14. Let's see, do we need anything else? No. We can just straight run our way up the tech tree. The Protoss have arrived at another settlement, sir. Alright, that's running, that's running, that is running. Let's see what we can do. Certainly. No! Oh, heal first. Now, I don't actually need these to do anything in. Actually, I do, because we can literally heal in battle. Let's uh, call these two, call these one, hold these back. Transformation systems. Not enough minerals. That's unfortunate. I tried to save that. Uh, right, let's land. Now, these are, of course, sentries, which means they don't do a lot of damage. VTOL engaged. engaged, indeed. Energy output is peaking. Oh, yeah, but those are zealots. Let's do some, uh, the equivalent of Burrow Micro. For Terran. Right, more stuff incoming. Yeah, but this time we actually got upgrades. Not enough minerals. Go on. Not enough minerals. This time we got upgrades and we got healing and we got a large fleet. They don't have shit. That was a close one. Thanks. The colonists have successfully evacuated that settlement. Let's get into the fight. Rece Receiving headquarters. You read fight or fight. Uh, right. Fight. Next nexus. Uh, we could move up here with ground units, but that's just not going to fly. <laughs> Sorry, that was terrible. Lost all... Whoa, 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 boys. Boys, you missed something. Okay, now let's, let's go. These marines in that bunker can deal with this. Okay, well, maybe not. Alright, now that that's done. For fuck's sake. Alright, now that we actually have this entire assault force, let's go fuck them up. And we do need that bunker back. What? Oh, he needs a barracks. You need a barracks to build a bunker. This is logical. Let's go fuck them up. You guys stay in here. They've almost reached the next base. Hurry! They'll be fine. Don't worry about it. Oh, wait, shit, there's Don't stuff there. Uh, get there. We oh, that's a lot of money. I'm willing to sacrifice a couple of Vikings for that. Not that many. Yeah, okay, got it. That was worth. May not have seemed worth, but that was worth. Okay, now we go back. Build a bunch more stuff. And we'll be fine. Ooh, I'm glad everyone's agreeing that the purifier is a rather big purifier. On the settlement any second now. Get clear. Let's get into 
Uh, right, we got 2-2 two, two now. We are fine. Let's go wreck that Nexus, and then we're done. Well, we still have to kill the Purifier, but... Uh, supply Depots, eh? Ah, uh, yes. Supply Depot. We have dismissed that notion. Command Biodome. Look, it's actually a command center, only with a different top. That's actually the first time I see that. Every time you look at the... Oh, sh oh no. Oh, no. Oh, that was Psy Storm. Ah, uh, I just lost the vast majority of my Vikings. Well, thanks, Command Biodome. And thanks me for getting distracted there. That was completely my fault. Dude, they already destroyed my ships. You could have given me a warning for that one, game. Thank you. Those Protoss almost got us. Excellent work. Okay, well, that settlement have been evacuated. Luckily, we still have this. Systems bribed. All right. Can we just talk about how bad that was, though? That was really destructive. Oh, look, more dudes. Oh, those are three carriers. Uh, I gotta make sure not to have my Vikings fly in the path of that thing, because I think it two shots Vikings. So we're just gonna put you guys there. Let's get into the fight. Oh, oh, great immortals. Um. Uh, lots of gas, nothing to spend it on. Okay, now we gotta move back here. No, not not via that route. It does actually two shot Vikings. Okay, um, I can't attack these with these because they will just die. Estimate Protoss arrival at the next colony base. I need to take down the shields on these before I can actually attack them. And even then, it's going to take quite a few lives. But at least now we won't get wrecked by the immortal shields. Okay, where are these? Right over there. Oh God. All right, this is what we got. Let's do it. Uh, can we? No, 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 that's it. We just spent all our money. All right, that's what we got. Let's hope it works. Let's get into the fight. There's a lot of stuff here. Can we come in from the back? They came from behind. That's a large fucking hole, though. That's a Mass Effect Reaper type looking shit. Fight or flight. Where's my science vessels? They're ready to fire their plant cracker. We've got to stop that purifier. Let's get into the fight. <laughs> so now it's a planet cracker. Greetings, come on. I mean, it is quite impressive. You ready for? I look, guys, curving turbo lasers. I like it. Everyone is triggered with PTSD. All right, let's get him from behind. Let's get into the fight. That's an Archon. Our archons do splash damage. Okay, so half of you go there, half of you go there. Ow. Ow, that is Storm. Land. Oh, that size storm was really quite poor. This choke is great, though, for me. Let's just kill the Nexus and get out. We don't have anything else left. And now to kill the Purifier. I don't... I, I literally don't know if this is possible with this group. How many armor? That's not too bad. That's just two armor. Rift... Per no. Well, those are the infested uh, colonists. They're dead. Sorry, guys. They're heading to the last base. 
This is it, boys. Into the line. Yeah, thanks. You ready for war? Okay, with the healing of the science vessels, I may keep them alive. Hang on, don't they also at the same time like warp in shit? I don't know. We'll, guess we'll find out. Gotta attack with everything at once. That is absolutely uh, the case. If this thing size storms, we are. Oh look, science vessels have more health. Uh. Okay. Okay. Ah, uh, look, I think we got it. I think we may have it. Wow, that fucking mothership's a woozy. Look at that, it doesn't warp in new units, it doesn't do shit, look. The purifier sent our units into a dimensional warp field. No, it didn't. Oh, it does try to warp in new shit. Whew. That, I actually thought it would be warping in, like, carriers and everything once we started attacking it. You've done it! I guess when you're Jane Rayner, they simply let you do it. Grab that mothership straight by the purifier. Units killed by purifier. 49.